Hello, everybody. Hope you're all having a wonderful, well, I guess it's almost evening time. You might be in bed. <laughs> um, sorry, I'm running a little late tonight. I had some later meetings this evening. Uh, but I wanted to go on and talk to you about transferable skills. I had a conversation today earlier with someone who was feeling like maybe the skills um, that they had were not transferable to other roles. And so I thought it's important to talk about that because I think it's really easy to get stuck in a place where we think, you know, this is what I've done. This is all I know. I don't think that's going to work in another place. And what I wanted to share with them today is just, there's so many more transferable skills than you realize, obviously. Leadership being one of them, communication, project management, um, the ability to take initiative, get things done, uh, lead a program, lead people. There's a lot of things there that I think are more transferable than people realize. And I think for me, I didn't realize that until um, at one point in my career, um, I was asked to lead network infrastructure. Now, I know nothing about network infrastructure at that point. I know a lot more now. But at that point, I knew nothing about network. And I said, you know, are you sure you want me to do that? Because that's not something I understand. And they said, we don't need you to understand the technology. We need you to be a leader and help the team grow and develop and move forward on the programs. And so for me, that was a big aha moment because I was able to go in there and successfully lead network infrastructure and learn a lot about it. And um, it's really helped me in, in more ways than I can think of right now. But I think the things that I realized were you have more to offer different roles than you think. And I've been able to move to different roles and take the things that I've learned in each previous role to the next one. And I think that's the other piece that I want you to think about is the roles that you've had. What have you learned? What have you been able to take and apply what are those lessons that you can take and move to the next type of role and that means that role may be in a different industry it may be a different type of role it may be um, something different than you've ever done but just think about what would the skills be needed for that role do you have something like that do you have some experience in your past and that doesn't mean it has to be with a company it may be a volunteer thing it may be um, something that you've done for a charity, it may be something that you've done for your kid's school, being on a board, being part of a nonprofit, all of those things translate into leadership or into project management or just even like things around finance, things around um, researching, things around maybe supply chain if you're doing something from an inventory standpoint. So there are a lot of things that I think you have to offer and so I ask you to just if you're looking to change roles, if you're looking to move to something different and you'd like it to be something different than you've done, don't discount what you have. Be open to those things. Take an inventory of the things that you've accomplished, the types of roles that you've done, the things that you've enjoyed, and really spend the time to do that because you have more to offer than you realize. And I want you to realize that and be able to share that story when you're in an interview or when you're in an maybe a networking conversation, something that you may have discounted that other people would find valuable. So think about that for yourself and be open. Um, happy to look at a list of those things and, and help you come up with new ideas if you need it, because I want you to be open to possibilities and not shut yourself down and limit yourself to something because you don't think that you have the right skills. I bet you do, and I bet you have way more than you're giving yourself credit for. I hope you're having a wonderful evening. I still have openings for the visibility class next week and also the new manager class uh, in two weeks, which is the 27th is when that starts. So if you have interest or know of anybody, please let me know. Otherwise, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your evening and I will talk to you next week. Thanks.